Yes. <clears throat> Good afternoon, my dear friends, my dear students, my dear brothers and sisters, and ladies and gentlemen. Welcome to VK Online Education. The usual questions I asked is today is today. Today is Thursday. And one more question I ask about: Do you have your breakfast? Yes, sir. I had. No, sir. I didn't have. Like that, you can say. <clears throat> What about lunch? Did you have your lunch? Yes, sir. I had. I had rice with rasam. I had rice with vegetable curry. I had beaten rice. I will keep you updated. Or I had palau. Or I had vegetable biryani. Or I had some vegetable rice. or something like that you can say <laughs> and one more question i last at what time did you have your lunch eppudu chesaro anamata time at what time sir i had my lunch at 130 i had my lunch at 2 o'clock like that you can say and what did sir teach you yesterday <laughs> if somebody will ask you i didn't come to class yesterday nenu ninna class ki raledu yesterday sir taught us or sir taught me okre unte me more than one is asan chapala sir taught us about the abbreviations about the contract form and expanded form the before christ atm automated teller machine like that mbbs bachelor of medicine bachelor of science <coughs> coming to cctv closed circuit television like that <coughs> Are very very important in English because we don't write how we pronounce, we don't write as we pronounce. So, what the writing will be something different, and the pronunciation will be something different. That is English. <coughs> Whereas in other languages, what happens here is you write as you pronounce, but in English it is not like that. various examples are there some silent words some silent letters are there and many things are like like that okay you should be very careful so yesterday i taught you about some phrases and about the expansions okay now coming to <coughs> you will ask what sir what will you teach today what will you teach us today ma ki ipodiyam nerpistaru same you can use with will and would in the same context you can use will and would in the present form and would can also be used in the past form like that you can say so today i will tell you <coughs> teach you about some of the phrases and idioms <coughs> if you put for example what is white is not milk tellu unde danta pal kadantam kada adi emana telu chuste adi oke madri kaadu adi daan madrine kaadu అది తెల్లగుంటే అది పరికి అప్పుడు మేము ఈ వర్డ్ చూస్ చేస్తాం ఈ సెంటెన్స్ చూస్ చేస్తాం వాట్ ఇస్ వైట్ ఇస్ నాట్ వాట్ ఇస్ వైట్ ఇస్ నాట్ మిల్క్ వాట్ గ్లిటర్స్ ఇస్ నాట్ గోల్డ్ వాట్ గ్లిటర్స్ ఇస్ నాట్ గోల్డ్ ఆల్ దట్ గ్లిటర్స్ ఇస్ నాట్ గోల్డ్ అంటే అంత బాగా షైనింగ్ ఉంటుంది ఈ వర్డ్స్ యూస్ చేయాలి సో సంథింగ్ లైక్ దట్ మెనీ వర్డ్స్ ఆర్ దట్ టైమ్ అండ్ టైడ్ విల్ నాట్ వెయిట్ ఫర్ నన్ టైమ్ అండ్ టైడ్ విల్ నాట్ వెయిట్ ఫర్ నన్ అంటే సమయం కానీ అనక సముద్రంలో అలలు వస్తుంది కదా అది యోర్కి వెయిట్ చేయదు అని అర్థం అంటే మేము యోర్కి వెయిట్ చేయకూడదు మేము టైం వేస్ట్ చేయకూడదు అని అన్నమాట అంటే ఏమి ఇంపార్టెంట్ ఎంత పెద్ద మనిషి ఉంటాను ఆ గడియారం మాత్రం నిలిసేయలేదు పెద్ద మనిషి వస్తూ ఉండరు నిలబెడతాము ఆయన లేట్ అయిపోయింది పని ఉంది ఆయన ఎప్పుడు పని స్టార్ట్ చేస్తారు అప్పుడు నేను స్టార్ట్ అవుతాను అన్న మాదిరి గడియారం చెప్పదు అదే మాదిరి అలలు ఉంటుంది కదా సముద్రంలో అది నువ్వు చెప్పదు సో వాట్ హ్యాపెన్స్ టైమ్ అండ్ టైమ్ అండ్ వేవ్స్ విల్ నాట్ వెయిట్ ఫర్ నన్ ఇట్ విల్ నాట్ వెయిట్ ఫర్ నన్ ఇట్ ద వేవ్స్ విల్ గో అండ్ గో టైడ్ మీన్స్ వేవ్స్ టైమ్ ఆల్సో విల్ నాట్ హౌ ఎవర్ ద గ్రేట్ పర్సన్ ఇస్ మే బీ ఎ కింగ్ మే బీ ద ప్రెసిడెంట్ ఆర్ మే బీ ది ప్రైమ్ మినిస్టర్ ఆర్ మే ది క్వీన్ సో టైమ్ విల్ నాట్ వెయిట్ ఫర్ ఎనీ వన్ ఇట్ విల్ కీప్స్ ఆన్ మూవింగ్ whether you come late or not it will not wait okay so this is about the phrases and term anaka where there is will there is a way ekkada manasu untundo 
ఎక్కడ చేయాలని ఉంటుందో దానికి ఒక దారి ఉంటుంది అనే అర్థం దానికి వేర్ దర్ ఇస్ విల్ మనసు ఉండేది ఇది మా చేతులు అవదు సార్ ఈ చేతులు చేసే ఏమే ఉండవు ఎలాగా చేయాలా ఎలాగ ఎలా ఎలా కష్టపడి మేము చేయాలా ఎట్లా చేయాలని చేసి ఉందనమాట దేర్ దే ఐ టెల్ యూ నెరేటివ్ షార్ట్ స్టోరీ వేర్ దర్ ఇస్ విల్ దర్ ఇస్ అ వే ఆర్ లెర్న్ ది స్టోరీ టు బి ఇన్ అవర్ కన్నడ మీడియం మే బి ఇన్ కన్నడ మీడియం ఇఫ్ యూ హ్యాపన్ టు స్టడీ ఇన్ ఇంగ్లీష్ మీడియం ద టీచర్ వుడ్ హ్యావ్ నెరేటెడ్ ది స్టోరీ అబౌట్ ది ఇక్కడ ఎలా ఎత్తుకొని పోతుంది ఎలా నీళ్ళు తాకుతుంది అని అనమాట అందుకే దానికి ఇది ఫేస్ ఇచ్చి వాట్ వన్స్ ఇట్ హ్యాపన్ ఏ క్రో వాస్ ఇన్ సర్చ్ ఆఫ్ వాటర్ ఏ క్రో వాస్ థర్స్టీ ఇట్ ఎంటర్ ఇన్ టు ఏ గార్డెన్ ఇన్ సర్చ్ ఆఫ్ వాటర్ ఇట్ సర్చ్ అండ్ సో ఏ పిక్చర్ బిలో ద ట్రీ అంటే పిక్చర్ మీన్స్ పిఐటిఆర్ మీన్స్ ఏ పాట్ వాటర్ ఇన్ టు ది పాట్ when it went near the pot and peeped into the pot like this peeped ante chusindi there was only little water it could not reach chana chinni undu kada lopta poi taage kavadu so the crow could not reach the water there was only little water and it was below so it thought of an idea and then took idea of the intelligent among birds is the crow the most intelligent among the birds is the crow so what it did it thought of an idea it collected some small stones <coughs> it collected some small pebbles and put under and dropped one by one into the pot it collected small stones on the ground or pebbles and dropped one by one into the pot after some time the water level raised after some time the water level raised and it could able to drink water or you can say it was able to drink water it was able to drink water it drank the water quenched its thirst dagam teerinde anamata quenched q u e n c h t quenched its thirst and it flew away happily chaala santoshamga pari poyind anamata so this is about the about the small story about the thirsty crow you might have listened or you might have heard when the teacher would have told you in class 1 or in standard 1 or standard 2 so that is where where there is will there is a way ekkada manike manasu untundo danki etla na dari unde untundi anamata now coming to yes i read out yeah <coughs> i got some phrases over here i'll read out he is caught between the devil and the deep sea this is a phrase between two dangers వాడు రెండు డేంజర్లో మాట్కొని ఉండండి మాట ఇక్కడ ఇలాగే పోయట్లేదు లెఫ్ట్కి పోయట్లేదు రైట్కి పోయట్లేదు పైన పోయట్లేదు కింద పోయట్లేదు సెంట్రల్లో కూడా చిక్కుని ఉండాలండి మాట రెండు రెండు సైడ్లో డేంజర్ ఉంది అనమాట దట్ ఈస్ ద ఫేస్ ఇస్ కాల్డ్ హీ ఇస్ హీ ఈస్ దెర్ ఇస్ అ ప్రాబ్లం సమ్ సమ్థింగ్ డీప్ అండ్ డెవిల్ అంటే భూతం డీప్ సి అంటే సముద్రం ఇలాగ పోతే భూతం తినేస్తుంది ilaga pote yes to me. both sides he has got a problem if he go this way there is a problem if he go that way there is a problem appudu me em cheptam ante central em chesetledu there is no other go he has to stand in one place that is he is caught between the between the devil and the deep sea ani idu ok phrase cat and dog life everybody has a cat and dog life it is full of quarrels ఇంట్లో ఎప్పుడు క్వార్లు ఉంటుంది హస్బెండ్ అండ్ వైఫ్ విల్ బి క్వార్లింగ్ బ్రదర్ అండ్ సిస్టర్ విల్ బి క్వార్లింగ్ ఆర్ బ్రదర్స్ విల్ బి క్వార్లింగ్ సంథింగ్ ఇన్ ఆఫీస్ ద బాస్ అండ్ ది ఇస్ కంపేర్ దిస్ క్యాట్ అండ్ డాగ్ లైఫ్ మీన్స్ వెన్ ద డాగ్ సీస్ ఎ క్యాట్ ఇట్ విల్ స్టార్ట్ ఫైటింగ్ వెన్ ద క్యాట్ సీస్ ఎ డాగ్ ఇట్ విల్ స్టార్ట్ రన్నింగ్ వెన్ ద క్యాట్ ఇస్ బిగ్ అండ్ ద డాగ్ ఇస్ స్మాల్ బోత్ విల్ స్టాండ్ ఫేసింగ్ టుగెదర్ అండ్ స్టార్ట్ ద డాగ్ ద డాగ్ విల్ స్టార్ట్ క్యాట్ ఎక్స్ చూస్తే డాగ్ అవ్వదు అప్పుడు మన ఇద్దరులో ఎవరికైనా అవదంటే అప్పుడు ఏం చెప్పాలి మేము ఇట్స్ ఎ క్యాట్ అండ్ డాగ్స్ లైఫ్ అని చెప్పుకుంటున్నాను సో దిస్ ఇస్ అ ఫేస్ అక్కడ అవలేదంటే ఈ సెంటెన్స్ యూస్ చేయాలి టు బ్రేక్ ద ఐస్ ఈ బ్రోక్ ద ఐస్ అంటే ఐస్ తీసుకొచ్చి కొట్టేది కాదు ఈ వాస్ కీపింగ్ పోయిట్ ఫర్ సో మెనీ డేస్ చాలా రోజులు ఇంకా మాట్లాడలేదు వాళ్ళు సడన్ గా మాట్లాడాడు దట్ ఈస్ మీన్స్ బ్రోక్ ద హీ బ్రేక్ ద ఐస్ హీ బ్రోక్ then you have to break the ice means you have to start speaking appudu to break the ice ante vaadu maatadaki start chesadanne maata so coming to 
రైనింగ్ క్యాట్స్ అండ్ డాగ్స్ రైనింగ్ క్యాట్స్ అండ్ డాగ్స్ అంటే చాలా ఇట్ ఈస్ హెవీ రెయిన్స్ విత్ ఇట్స్ రైనింగ్ హెవీలీ అని అర్థం రైనింగ్ క్యాట్స్ అండ్ డాగ్స్ అంటే రైనింగ్ హెవీలీ క్యాట్స్ అండ్ డాగ్స్ అంటే విత్ థండర్ స్టామ్ అంటే శబ్దం వచ్చి గాలి ఇది శబ్దము వాళ్ళ ఊ హీ అని శబ్దము ఎలాగా పిల్లిను కుక్క జగడం చాలా హెవీ రేంజ్ విత్ సౌండ్ ది వే ది వెన్ ది ద వేవింగ్ ఆఫ్ ది వేవింగ్ ఆఫ్ ది ట్రీస్ దిస్ థింగ్ బ్రాంచెస్ వెన్ దెర్ ఇస్ ఎ హెవీ బ్లో ఆఫ్ ద విండ్ when there is a heavy flow of the wind you can see the trees moving <coughs> in opposite directions or alternate direction so you could see the sound we could see the sound when the wind is blowing and it is hitting the trees or something like that so it is compared to it is compared to it is raining cats and dogs chaala sabdu moste not only water chaala sabdu moste apudu cheppali it's raining cats and dogs to die in harness ante hechi r in yes ante pan chese tappudu vaadu sachi putadu annamata so he will die to the last minute of the life <coughs> he will not sit quite <coughs> till the last moment he was working sachi oru kodu pan chestha unnadu annamata anta mandi chaala takku untaru retired ayin that is not there see when you a person dies in harness while he was working till the last moment of his death till the last minute of his death he will be working apudu em chopa he died in harness so abdul kalam died in harness vaga lecture chetapude when he was teaching <coughs> when he was giving a lecture in shimla he fell down and he collapsed akade so no pani chese teppudu apudu chellipothadu kada apudu ante vaadiki rest ledene kadu eppudu start chestadu pani vaadu sachche urki pani chestha unnadu annamata that means you have to say that he died in harness in chapala <coughs> yeah a close shave a close shave ante he had a close shave in the accident he had a close shave in the accident ante ante he missed there was a very big accident danta oda escape ayipoyadu anamata konchu touch ayindeno pranam poyedi anamata if it has been touched the vehicle done past the some other vehicle or the road barricade or the pole or something like that it missed so he was escaped so it is called a narrow escape a close shave a close he would have died accident emana ayunte chalapoyadu annamata so close shave ante it was a very narrow escape coming to my yeah my cousin is a confirmed bachelor yesterday also i told about this confirmed bachelor means he will not get not to get married in his lifetime see for example <coughs> watch by abdul kalam salman khan kamaraj of uh, uh, the former chief minister of tamil nadu he was also a confirmed bachelor watch by also was a confirmed bachelor salman khan i don't think he will get married he is already cross more than 55 and apg abdul kalam was a confirmed bachelor like that many people are there who have not gained got married during their lifetime they passed away the thing is <coughs> it is not that they hate women adolu suste ishtam ledane kaadu valki they dislike their sister they dislike their younger sister they dislike their auntie or something like that it is not that they dislike women it is something like that they do not want to get married they are not interested in married life anamata valu adolu suste ishtam ledane kaadu so confirmed bachelor ante వాళ్ళు తీర్మానం చేసుకుని ఉంటారు పెళ్లి చేసుకోకూడదు లైఫ్ లో అని సో తీసుకోండి కన్ఫర్మ్ బ్యాచ్లో కమింగ్ టు ఈ రెస్ట్లెస్ అంటే రెస్ట్ లేకుండా పని చేస్తాడు అనే కాదు వాడు ఇక్కడ పోతాడు అక్కడ వస్తాడు పైన పోతాడు కింద వస్తాడు సో దట్ ఈస్ వాట్ ఈస్ కాల్ ఈజ్ లెట్ మీట్ కన్ఫ్యూజ్ ఈ టేక్స్ ద ఫోన్ ఈ కాల్స్ అండ్ ఈ కీప్స్ ద ఫోన్ ఈ గోస్ అండ్ సిట్స్ దేర్ ఈ కమ్స్ దేర్ ఈ గోస్ అండ్ సిట్స్ హియర్ he goes up he comes down <coughs> he keeps moving without rest he keeps moving from one place to another in rest so that is called he is restless restless means restless that is yes kith and kin relatives and friends and relatives <coughs> i went to my hometown to meet my kith and kin kith and the friends so kin and relatives the other meaning of kith is friends the other meaning of kin is relatives 
I went to my hometown to see my kith and kin. So this is a phrase. So all in all, he is all in all. She is all in all. He knows to play cricket. He knows to play hockey. He knows to play basketball. He knows to teach maths. He knows to teach science. He knows to teach English. At the same time, he can also teach Telugu. <coughs> he plays violin. He plays guitar. He is on the road. You can say that. Chana panil tilsu nante. He is all in all. He is all in all. He is all in all. But he is all in all. He is all in all. He is all in all. You give him this work. You give him filing work. You ask him to go here. You ask him to deposit money. You ask him to work on the system. You ask him to write a letter. Anything that means he is all in all. And he is all in all. He is all in all. She is all in all. He is all in all. Coming to the next one. At 6 and 6. At 6 and 7. At 6 and 7. He is all in all. He is all in all. At 6 and 7. He is all in all. He is at six and seven cent. He is. It is in disorder. It is in at six and seven means it is in order. Apuru. It is in six and seven cent chapter. Okay. Now coming to yes. <coughs> at stake. This bridge is at stake. This house is at stake. This apartment is at stake. Ante adi danger gondi sari ledo. It is any time it may fall. Any time the bridge may broke, sorry. Any time the bridge bridge may break. Any time this building will fall because due to rain, it has become damp. Aim, a poor kind of danger was shown. At stake, and there, that means it is under danger. It is in danger. This house is in stake. Any time it can fall, it may fall, and this apartment is in stake. It may in stake, and there in danger. Any matter. Okay, yes. We are coming to. <clears throat> at the 11th hour he came and told me at the 11th hour he came and told me at the 11th hour ante 12 gantlu kodu cheppadu anne kadu he came and told me when there was very less time it's 4 o'clock my office gets over at 5 o'clock ma boss ochu kadu ee pani chese ke kavala chesnaka meer ellu povachu so it takes more than 3 or 4 hours to complete that work how can he do, how can he do within one year how can he do within one hour when the time required to complete that work is 3 hours it takes 3 hours time or 4 hours time to complete that work and when there is only one hour time your boss is telling me at the 11th hour ante chaana late ki chopadanne mata tomorrow there is interview you are telling you are tomorrow 10 o'clock there is an interview today night you are coming and telling me tomorrow there is an interview 10 o'clock for that Rape take exam and you put your PL prepare. Go there. You should tell me at least one week before or fifteen days before, whatever it is. So the dress change, go in, take for you bottle, let's go quick and say for today. So that means you are telling me at the eleventh hour enter, eleventh hour ante, eleventh hour or in advance which you prepare. Ante he told me at the eleventh hour, so I was not able to finish the work. I was not able to complete the work. I was not able to fulfill his duties. Any chapter, eleventh hour, ante late which chapter no matter. A hard nut to crack, <coughs> a hard nut to crack, ante but chana customary vakti, chana mundi na tumu. I am chapter no inodo. It's very difficult to convince him. A hard nut to crack, ante chana pet the samasya problem. A problem ante easy ga. It will take more time. So that is what you say. A jagal nimeam chupta mante. It's a hard nut to crack and chupta. So coming to a a red letter day, happy day. If I get a promotion, that is that is my red letter day. If I get married to that particular girl, that is a red letter day. If India wins the game with very great difficulty, that is a red letter day. If I get an opportunity to go abroad, that is a very red letter day. My son has appeared for the exam. If he gets a seat for MBBS, that is after two years, three years, there is no child. If I get a child, that is a red letter day. My promotion is a red letter day. My transfer is a red letter day. Whatever it, you get, sama santosh main dinu mane mata. So that is called. It phrase which I have told, sir, it is a red letter day. Enter. Red letter ante 
రెడ్ రెడ్ లో రెడ్ పెన్ లో రాసింది కాదు రెడ్ లెట్ రెడ్ అంటే ఇట్స్ వెరీ నైస్ టీ అని అర్థం ఎస్ బ్యాగ్ బ్యాగ్ అండ్ బ్యాగేజ్ అంటే హిట్ ది బ్యాగ్ యాజ్ వెల్ యాజ్ బిలాంగింగ్స్ బ్యాగ్ అంటే ఉట్టివాడు బ్యాగ్ మాత్రం కాదు బ్యాగేజ్ అంటే వాడిది సామాన్లు అంతా ఎత్తుకుని పోయినాడు అనమాట హీ టు హీ వెకేటెడ్ ద హౌస్ విత్ బ్యాగ్ అండ్ బ్యాగేజ్ బ్యాగేజ్ మీన్స్ హాల్ ఇస్ బిలాంగింగ్స్ టేబుల్ చైర్ కార్డ్ ఫ్రిడ్జ్ వాషింగ్ మిషన్ బ్యాగేజ్ అంటే హాల్ ఇస్ బిలాంగింగ్స్ బ్యాగ్ మీన్స్ ఓన్లీ బ్యాగ్ ఓకే హీ టు ఇస్ బ్యాగ్ అండ్ బ్యాగేజ్ హీ వెకేటెడ్ ద హౌస్ ఇస్ బ్యాడ్ డెట్ బిఏడ్ బ్యాడ్ డెట్ డిఈబిటి డెట్ మీన్స్ చాలా he has bad debts in the bank because bad debts ante chana loan undi tirpichi kavukonde oka paristhiti he has bad debt in the bank so so that is called loan it's very difficult to clear the loan and bear it in mind whatever i say you should bear it in mind means you should remember bear it in mind ante eppudu gavanam pettukollalane mata you should always uh, you should always remember the other word is bear it in mind b e a r what it is so coming to next is life is not a bed of roses but it is full of bliss and sorrows life on any bed of roses mari kadu eppudu santosham kadu dukham untundi anamata ma life ante if you are living for 60 years or 8 years all the 8 years will not be happy all the 8 years will not be sad it will be 50 50 or 60 20 whatever it all depends upon కొంచెం సుఖము ఉంటుంది కొంచెం దుఃఖము ఉంటుంది ఎప్పుడు దుఃఖమే కాదు ఎప్పుడు సుఖమే కాదు దట్ ఈస్ వాట్ లైఫ్ ఏమంటారంటే లైఫ్ ఈస్ నాట్ ఎ బెడ్ ఆఫ్ రోసెస్ ఇట్ ఈస్ ఫుల్ ఆఫ్ బ్లిస్ అండ్ సార్ ఇట్ ఈస్ మిక్స్డ్ కష్టం ఉంటుంది దుఃఖం ఉంటుంది సంతోషం ఉంటుంది అనమాట లైఫ్ లో అందరూ దెర్ ఇస్ నో పర్సన్ హుస్ లివ్ లివ్డ్ విత్ ఆల్ ప్రాబ్లమ్స్ ఆర్ డిఫికల్టీ సారోస్ త్రోట్ ఇస్ లైఫ్ ఇస్ నాథింగ్ లైక్ ఇట్ ఈస్ 40 60 40 కొంచెం దుఃఖం ఉంటే కొంచెం కష్టం ఉంటుంది కొంచెం కష్టం ఉంటే కొంచెం సుఖం ఉంటుంది అన్నమాట సో దట్ ఇస్ వాట్ ఇట్స్ ఎ ఫేస్ లైఫ్ ఇస్ నాట్ ఎ బెడ్ ఆఫ్ రోజెస్ ఇట్స్ ఫుల్ ఆఫ్ బ్లిస్ అండ్ సారోస్ అని చెప్పాలి ఇట్స్ ఎ జనరల్ స్టేట్మెంట్ కమింగ్ టు బెల్ ద క్యాట్ హూ విల్ బెల్ ద క్యాట్ పిల్లికి గంట కట్టేవారు ఎవరు అనమాట దట్ మీన్స్ హూ విల్ టేక్ ద రిస్క్ ఇట్స్ ఎ వెరీ రిస్కీ జాబ్ ఇట్ ఈస్ ఎ వెరీ రిస్కీ జాబ్ so all the rats one day what happened 10 12 rats assembled in one place and they were very afraid of the cat the cat will come and kill the rats so they had a rat there was a meeting one sabdu ni takshame me escape avachu we have to bell the cat while the cat is coming we could hear the sound of the bell so that when we could hear we know that the cat is coming so that now the yes they they could find an idea now the i they could find an idea solution who will bell the cat elkal poi bell chese kona that it's a very risky job appudu cheptaru who will bell the cat ante appudu who will take the risk and adugulu appudu em antaru ante ikkada it's a phrase who will bell the cat means who will take the risk and solve this problem and do this work and after coming to yes birds of the same feather బర్డ్స్ ఆఫ్ ద సేమ్ పెదర్ అంటే ఒకే పక్షులు ఒకే పక్షులు ఒకే కలర్ వచ్చి ఒకే మాదిరి పారుతుంది అనమాట ఎగురుతుంది అనమాట ఇజెంటెడ్ ఇట్ విల్ ఫ్లై ద బర్డ్స్ ఆఫ్ ద సేమ్ ఫెదర్ విల్ ఫ్లాక్ టుగెదర్ అంటారు ఇప్పుడు బర్డ్స్ ఆఫ్ ద సేమ్ ఫెదర్ ఇట్స్ ఎ గ్రూప్ ఆఫ్ పీపుల్ ద పర్సన్ హూ డ్రింక్స్ ద పర్సన్ హ్యాస్ ఎ హెల్పింగ్ నేచర్ హీ విల్ బీ విత్ దెమ్ ద పర్సన్ హ్యాస్ ఎ గుడ్ యాటిట్యూడ్ హీ విల్ బీ దెమ్ ద పర్సన్ హ్యాస్ ఎ రీడింగ్ హ్యాబిట్ the person has a writing habit the person with a good good behavior and character valanta oke madi attitude oke madi manasu undevulu oka gun oka group lo untaru appude em cheptam dan valiki oka group lo untaru andurki oke habits oke attitude untundi appude em cheptam memo you put it the phrase birds of the same feather and double they are all good people and kadu birds of the same feather means all the people in a group have the same attitude and habits and behavior okay like that <clears throat> all are graduates all are post graduates all are doctors something like that anni okay madri untu vala bhav to yes he told me at the that i did not 
that is not my cup of tea not my cup of tea ante adi i am not interested in that edana ok pani cheptaru edana pani cheptaru ichestaru ante that is not my cup of tea mean that means do you want to do this work are you interested in this ante i am not interested in chopkurdu but cheptadu i am not interested in there is a phrase for that that is not my cup of tea that means i am not interested in arthu if you are not interested you will see in a different phrase that is not my cup of tea okay that means i don't like to do it the <clears throat> coming to a hot potato speak about an issue mostly current hot potato and latest news eda the latest news ante today news is the hot potato ipo the news vachi adhe hot potato konchi rojulu maatadtara dan gurinchi maatadtara about the covid when it came in the beginning it was a hot potato about the floods when days pass on it is not still in hot potato something very important news it is called the hot potato for the current news it's called hot potato very recently after few days they will forget so coming to actions speaks louder actions speak louder ante the person who simply speaks he won't do any work utti matadtadu chesi sutiyala that is called adhe chaala gand doesn't speak will do something so that apade emantaru action speak loud ante vaadu pani chetka not just simply speaking utti maatadthe maatram kaadu adi pani chesu sutiyala appudu ikkada face face cheptam you keep on saying but you don't do anything cheptane untadu em cheyadu appudu ivadu use cheyala action speaks actions speak louder <coughs> that means people intentions can be judged better by what they do and not this way they have to do okay that is about that coming to the ball is in your court the ball is in your court means the decision the decision is in your hand ni chetra decision undi anamata whether you can say some decision about giving action about terminating him about giving a transfer or about giving about organizing a trip yes or no anta nee chetlo undinna mata appudu nee chetlo undinna ante em cheppala the ball is in your court whether to say or yes whether to decide or not to decide well, i told you know promotion demotion transfer hike in the salary or lower in the salary retirement emana kavachchu adi nee chetlo undinna mata appudu it is in your in your hand and you can say but the other way of telling is the ball is in your court okay something like that so coming to once in a blue moon once in a blue moon ante blue moon once in a blue moon ante eppudu chaana rarely he comes to my house once in a blue moon moodu nelliki ledha aaru nelliki okka sathi vastadu he goes to church or temple once in a blue moon eppadana okka sathi church ki pothadu temple pothadu he drinks once in a blue moon he smokes in a group once in a blue moon eppudu cheyadu vadu sometimes maybe once in 3 months or once in 6 months like that you do my grandfather goes out for a walk he has become very old once in a blue moon daily pod yeah okay something like that. once in 3 months once in 4 months so i am purely a vegetarian by eat non veg once in a blue moon eppadu no okati maybe once in 3 3 months once in 4 months or some occasions some serials once in a blue moon i watch movies once in a blue moon ఎప్పుడైనా నాట్ డైలీ ఎప్పుడైనా ఒకసారి చేసేదానికి అప్పుడు చెప్తారు వన్ సీన్ బ్లూ మూన్ కమింగ్ టు మెన్ అవుట్ సైడ్ ది బాక్స్ మీన్ యు హ్యావ్ టు థింక్ సంథింగ్ డిఫరెంట్ థింక్ ఒకే మాదిరి అందరూ ఒకే మాదిరి యోచించేస్తారు పని చేస్తారు నువ్వు మాత్రము మేము మాత్రము వేరే లాగా యోచించేసి దాన్ని ఆ పనిని చాలా బాగా చేయాలి యు షుడ్ నాట్ సే యు షుడ్ నాట్ డూ వాట్ అదర్స్ థింక్ అవుట్ ఆఫ్ ద బాక్స్ అందరూ చేసే మాదిరి చేయకూడదు నువ్వు అందరూ చెప్పే మాది చెప్పకూడదు నువ్వే వేరే వేరే రకాల చెప్పాల యూ హ్యావ్ టు డూ యూ హ్యావ్ టు సే అట్ డూ ఇన్ ఎ డిఫరెంట్ వే ఇట్ షుడ్ బి సంథింగ్ లైక్ దట్ ఇట్ షుడ్ బి మోర్ ఇంట్రెస్టింగ్ ఇట్ షుడ్ బి సంథింగ్ వెరీ బెనిఫిషియల్ ఓకే ఎస్ దట్ ఈస్ కాల్డ్ థింక్ అవుట్ సైడ్ ద బాక్స్ మీన్ థింక్ డిఫరెంట్లీ అన్కండిషనలీ క్రియేటివ్ థింకింగ్ అంటారు థింక్ అవుట్ సైడ్ ద బాక్స్ కమింగ్ టు రాలేదన్న మాట చేతికొచ్చింది నోత్ కొనలేని మాట సమ్డి యూస్ చెక్ వన్ ల్యాక్ రూపీ టుడే ఇస్ అ బ్యాంక్ హాలిడే టుమారో యూ హ్యావ్ టు గో అండ్ గెట్ ది చెక్ 
you will be thinking i am getting 1 lakh rupee the check is with me that means i have already received 1 lakh rupee the moment you go to the bank and present the check and the cashier says yes sir no sir there is no balance your check is returned balance the check wapas is registered you calculate something and go and you don't get it so that means many table you are about to drink there is a knock at the door somebody and your boss enters into the house or a very close friend comes you were about to drink that coffee you will offer the coffee to him so that means it misses many a slip between the cup and the lip ante chet vachindi note karaledu anamata something like a promotion you are about to get promoted some other candidate will get promoted everybody were telling that yes you will get promotion election also it happens bjp party or congress party everybody will be thinking bjp will win or congress will win suddenly the hopes you will be thinking bjp will suddenly congress will win the seat congress candidate will face of counting bjp candidate will win so that means what happens here is many a slip between the cup and the lip naaki chet kochindi not karalle den mat so it happens in most of the cases in our life also so this is a phase ఎప్పుడు చేతికి వచ్చింది సమ్ అదర్ మ్యాటర్ సమ్ సంథింగ్ లైక్ ఎ ప్రాపర్టీ సంథింగ్ లైక్ ఎ ప్రమోషన్ సంథింగ్ లైక్ ఎన్ ఇంక్రిమెంట్ ఇట్ ఈ ఫ్రెష్ చెప్తారు ఓకే ఎస్ కమింగ్ టు నౌ అబౌట్ ది ఫేసెస్ అబౌట్ ద ఫేసెస్ దిస్ ఐ ఆల్రెడీ బీన్ టెలింగ్ యూ ద ప్రీవియస్ క్లాస్ ఆల్సో హీ హ్యాస్ గివెన్ అప్ స్మోక్ హ్యాస్ వాళ్ళు హ్యాస్ గివెన్ అప్ స్మోకింగ్ మంచి హీ స్టాప్ స్మోకింగ్ అంటే ఇంక మీద తాగుడు అనమాట పర్మనెంట్లీ స్టాప్ he has given up playing cricket he has give, uh, given up biting nails he has given up drinking coffee or tea like that you can say so if you want to use have i have given up we have given up they have given up smoking chapterante vaalu taage nil petaru anamata you should not say left smoking or stop smoking chapkurudu given up ancha pala okay yes so coming to next is cut down on sugar and salt cut down on sugar and salt ante meeru sugar nu salt nu takkuva teeskondi anamata cut down on sugar if you have a bp problem cut down on salt if you take more salt you will be suffering from blood pressure if you take more sugar if you are already a diabetic you will be suffering from diabetes or something like sugar problem so the doctor will advise you take instead of saying okay my dear sir, student or we okay my dear friend you have to take less sugar instead of cut cheese it cut cut down sugar and salt means you have to take less sugar and less salt sugar our car broke down on the way broke down ante memo chete appudu stop ayipindi repair ayipindi broke down means not be breaking to pieces he broke the glass he broke the plate he broke the stone and chose adi kadu our car broke down while coming on the way ante రిపేర్ అయిపోయి అక్కడ నిలిచిపోయింది అనమాట ది ఎమ్మెల్యే బ్రోక్ డౌన్ మై గి బ్రోక్ డౌన్ వెన్ యూ హర్డ్ ద న్యూస్ దట్ హీస్ గ్రాండ్ మదర్ ఆర్ మదర్ పాస్ట్ అవే సడన్ గా ఒక మెసేజ్ వస్తుంది వాడికి యువర్ మదర్ ఇస్ నో మోర్ షీ పాస్ట్ అవే సంథింగ్ లైక్ దట్ సో ఇట్ విల్ బి ఎ షాకింగ్ న్యూస్ టు హిమ్ ఇట్ విల్ బి ఎ షాకింగ్ న్యూస్ టు హిమ్ సో హీ స్టార్ట్ హీ బ్రోక్ డౌన్ ఇన్ హీ స్టార్టెడ్ క్రైమ్ ఇండియా లాస్ ద మ్యాచ్ హీ బ్రోక్ డౌన్ హీ ఫెయిల్డ్ ఇన్ మ్యాచ్ ఆర్ సంథింగ్ లైక్ దట్ he failed in the subject he broke down started crying broke down and started crying in artham i am not in good books speaking terms or in speaking terms i am not in good books with him i am not in speaking terms with him ante naaki vaadki maatla ledu anta ledu nanni chuste vaadi kavudu vaadi vaadni chuste naa kavudu i am not in good terms ante we don't speak with each other and not in good books ante nakinu vaaki kaadu ane mata so that is what i am not in good books i am not in good i am not in not that means not in good relationship they exchange hot words they exchange hot words ante iddru jagal esukunnar anamata utti maata di excuse me sorry they exchange hot words ante 
they spoke in a bad language or something they started quarreling they started quarreling so they say she resembles her mother resembles means susik matram susik matram is vaadu vaalla naan laga undadu look at the difference between like and resemble resemble ante vaalla naan laga susik undadu he resembles his father she resembles her mother he is like his father in habits and behavior she is like her mother in habits and behavior not the facial expression facial ka suse ka ka not the appearance resembles means appearance like means behavior and character you got it this you should remember yes hard work always pays kashta pattare palam untun karnal chotta kada meer em kashta padtaru correct ga sincere ga honest ga results chaana guarantee if you work hard hard work always pays sincerely and honestly results are guaranteed not to he hardly works he hardly works and hardly works and he will not work at all once in a month or once in two months and once in three months he works he hardly works means he never works now coming to the ball is in your court I already told you the ball is in your court and a ball neither decision me chetlo undi na matter i am running short of funds i am running short of funds mean i have less money neither double led na matter i am running short of funds means i have less money i have no money to spend or i have no money to pay or something like that don't shrink work s h i r k don't shrink ante avoid cheyandi pani ni office lo avoid chesi kothunda can you avoid you cannot avoid the boss will say get out you have to do that work whether you like it or not you have to do so that will don't shrink work they say don't go out barefooted utti kallo povadandi chappal lekunda bayit povadandi anamata don't go out barefooted don't hide anything from me mucchu mari em nurbardu anchuttaru kada emi ledukunda baye padukunda daanchi pettukunda anni cheppalani anamata i am not telling you hide the things i am telling what all you know you have to say don't hide anything emem chopal undal an chopala edinu lose your temper ante keep cool calm ga undandi don't lose your temper ante kopam cheskoradandi anamata keep cool shantam ga undandi don't lose your temper ante kopam cheskonodandi anamata okay yes. so coming to don't speak ill of others say he is like this she is like that they are like that chaddaku matadukodu if you know anything bad about them don't about him that means they say don't speak ill about him don't speak god gurinchi tappaga matadadandi anamata don't study at the cost of your health don't study at the cost of your health ante chaala meer nidra lekunda tindi lekunda saduta unte em avutundi your health will be spoiled so why to waste time by eating why to waste time by playing why to waste time by sleeping you have to sleep you have to eat well you have to sleep max makes jack a dull boy utti pani cheskunte aatledante he will become dull only always you do only book one utti subject gurinchi telustundi kani veranta emi telledane mata so em cheptarante yes <coughs> don't study at the cost of your health avoiding food avoiding sleep if you keep on studying then your health will be spoiled apni uttaru don't study at the cost of your health don't hesitate to ask me ikku padadandi adige dantlo don't hesitate to ask any questions em anna adagandi nen answers chestanu anne mata okay he was accused of murder accused means punished the other reading of accused is punished em accused means he committed a crime he committed a crime it has been proved it is is punished police put him or her in a jail police put him her in a cell and tell c e l l cell means it is jail or prison he was convicted convicted means it has been proved that he has committed a crime emanu murder kavachu theft kavachu rape kavachu for he killed four people on the road maybe negligent or 
negligent driving or deliberately but have done it so he has been he was convicted or he is convicted means acquitted a c q u i t t e d he was acquitted means set free or paina emi dosham ledu edi proof ledu he was the proof undo vaadu kaadu where you know once any matter so at that time what we say he is acquitted means this are the words convicted means punished acquitted means set free vanni ursestar ni matter he was awarded a death sentence he was awarded a death sentence means hanging the judge awarded him a death sentence because he has committed a rape or a murder or only murder whatever it is he is a law abiding person he is a law abiding person ante chaana law gurinchi chaana maryadi kanun he follows and he respects law ignorance of law is no excuse ignorance of law ante నాకు తెలీదు మర్డర్ చేస్తే తప్పని తెలీదు దొంగతనం చేస్తే తప్పని తెలీదు అసాల్ట్ ఒకడిని కొడితే తప్పని తెలీదు ఇఫ్ యు హిట్ సంబడి విత్ ఎ స్టోన్ ఆర్ విత్ ఎ రాడ్ ఆర్ సంథింగ్ లైక్ దట్ దట్ ఈస్ ఆల్సో ఎన్ఫెన్స్ అసాల్టింగ్ సంబడి వితౌట్ ఎనీ రీజన్ ఆర్ విత్ రీజన్ ఆల్సో ఇట్ ఈస్ ఎన్ అఫెన్స్ సో నాకు తెలీదు నేను కొట్టేస్తిని నేను తెలీదు నాకు చంపేస్తిని నాకు తెలీదు నేను రేప్ చేస్తిని అంటే that is ignorance of law is no excuse than the excuse in a cause you will be punished you cannot say i don't know sir i did it no you will be punished <clears throat> he has left the house with bag and baggage i already told you he took the bag and all belongings he left the house or she left the house with bag and baggage ante with all belonging anni saman teeskoni illu kali cheskon porse endu matter he is at large he is at large ante not small he is at large ante he has vacated that place he is not in town he has escaped he is at large means police are searching him that means he has escaped paper lo untundi he is at large he has escaped the police are under the search Now coming to photography is strictly prohibited inside the temple prohibited means akada alu cheyirunna mata in tirupati in most of the places photography is strictly prohibited in the temple in, the, in inside the temple premises that means you are not allowed to take a camera you can take a cell phone or whatever to, but you are not allowed to take the photos so this is a rule see this is something like a rule condition ledo anninu strong ga undi but all is 32 teeth are intact now coming to he is blind in one eye he is blind in one eye ante vaadiki rendu kannulu undi ante oka kannu maatram telustundi kaani drushti untundi inkoka kannu vaadiki teliyadu anamata so he should not say he has only one eye in chuppudu he can see with only one eye in chuppudu two eyes are there but he could see in only one eye that is the meaning he is blind in one eye ante that means he could see in only one eye left or right the other eye other eye he cannot see is not able to see because of no vision or maybe due to some accident problem or to some birth problem emana undachu he is blind in one eye and that means he could see with only one eye maybe left or right alla chapachu yes <clears throat> the boy recited a poem or poem the boy recited a poem ante chapadu then he said the poem to you and he will alla twinkle twinkle little star like that there is a rhythm of saying there is a rhythm of saying a rhythm und pussy cat pussy cat where had you been i had been to london to see the queen something like that ad oka rhythm untund kada dan kem chuttar poem konji he recited a poem she recited a poem please recite a poem say in chapukundu okay read the poem and chapter and coming to next is these are the technical words he nar- can you tell a story in chapter narrate a story ante story chapete oka vidham untundi ilaga once a king lived he went to the forest for hunting like that so there is a rhythm of saying so story is narrated and poem is recited he recited a poem or poem he narrated a story in her so through her exams <clears throat> she got through the exam me she passed i went through the notes ante nen sadu tinnane mata ekkadu sudu 
did you go through the notes adi vere did you go through the notes when did you read i went through the notes past and yes sir nen sadutin anamata inkokto he got through the exam that means he passed ikkada vere meaning akkada vere meaning ikkada got through yes i went through here it is he got through mass exam he got through this exam like that you can see coming to she passed away last year he passed away last year ante chali poyinaru anamata he died last year ani cheppukudu when what about your parents you can say my mother is there my father is dead ani cheppukudu my father is there my mother is dead ani cheppukudu my father is there my mother is no more ani cheppala when she died ani kuda adukudu wait kudu when she paapadu maatru he died in a road accident when he was brought to the he was brought to the hospital <coughs> he was dead when he was brought to the hospital he was dead hospital tisukuna chapudu appudu dead ani chotta dead ani chotta only the <coughs> hospital authorities will say general ga memu cheppukudu then he will lead ante sir he is no more he passed away 7 years before how he passed away he died in an air accident he died on a road accident he died of heart attack he died of malaria like that you can see ela adukte appudu cheppala died or dead ani ledante chela poi unte he is no more or my mother is no more my grandfather is no more she is no more like that you can see so that is about the he passed away he died last year cheppala abdul kamalam passed away four years ago he was cremated ante vanni kaal chesar anamata illadante he was buried ante manu chesar anamata he was buried manu chesar he was cremated with burn chesar anamata crematorium a burning place ki cheptar crematorium see will burn or bury but christians and muslims they want burn they will only bury it is their custom custom ante sampradaya antaru it is their custom it is the tradition christians and muslims want burn the body when the body die and the person is dead when the person dies they will only bury only hindus neither they will bury nor burn cremate cremation is called burn okay our lunch break is at 130 our tea break is at 140 sorry 340 or 4 o'clock break break it is not something like breaking tea break and that is a time there is a break means that means you stop working and you have lunch you stop working there is a break means you stop again after the lunch you restart there is a tea break at 4:30 4:30 to 5 o'clock again from 5 to 6 you have to work so there is a break means you have been working you have, there there will be a break means you stop working there <coughs> he broke the name came breakfast into existence i will tell you last night you had your dinner at about 10 o'clock today you mo- you woke up at 6 o'clock you freshen up yourself you brushed your teeth washed your face had a bath and you will have your breakfast at 8 o'clock or 9 o'clock from 10 to 9 you didn't take anything for 11 hours that means you are fasting that means you are fasting when you start eating then you will break the fast that means i have my breakfast how to ask did you break the fast and adagali apade em ayipindante adi breakfast that is how the name existed because you are fasting when you start eating something that means you are breaking the fast so the tea break so you will stop working and you will have tea one more word is there yes i will tell you tomorrow yes i hope you i hope you enjoyed this class very much thank you for watching this video now i shall stop here i shall see you tomorrow at the same timing till then have a good day or you can say now the already it is 4 o'clock i can say good night i shall see you tomorrow till then have a good day so this is how i have to say god bless you loka samasta sukhino bhavantu सर्वे जनांग सुखी भवंत थैंक यू वेरी मच